what's up savages i hope you all had a great memorial weekend i know i did i did take the weekend off partied it on out just like everyone else out there but today i'm back with a crypto tip video about coins so i know that the markets are really low right now which is like the first time in a while that this has happened i know that the drops and the percentage drops also scares a lot of people but don't be this is the best time to invest this is the best time to start learning so just start putting in five bucks a month five bucks a week whatever you feel like is necessary to start learning about investing into crypto now i know it also can be overwhelming because you're like well how do i know what coin to pick well how do i know what research i need to look up how do i know what's important details or information about a coin i got you all set with today's video which we're going to be diving into something that i like to call the six make sure you guys like comment down below if you have any questions or if you think i missed something and make sure you subscribe hello i'm trying to get a little you know more of an audience out here <laughs> hopefully i'm appealing to you guys but anyways let's just get started and dive into the six number one is that you want the liquidity locked by the developers i know it's a funky word you're like what the hell is that basically it's very important that's all you need to know you need to see if they have a burn wallet or a locked wallet you can look this up by looking up the wallet address and if the address starts with 0x0000 that's a pretty good sign that the liquidity is locked Number two is scarcity, okay? What is the circulating supply of coins out there? Hmm? I know Bitcoin only has 21 million circulating supply, which is very good scarcity, okay? The lower the scarcity, the better. But, you know, sometimes you can only find coins that are between what I like to recommend, 100 million to 260 million. Number three is market cap. Basically, how much money is invested into this coin already, okay? Because if there's a coin that's already at $1 billion invested into it, in order for you to even make money off of that or to double, it needs to be have another $1 billion pumped into it. And in order for it to triple in price would be another $1 billion to triple in price. So sometimes some of these coins that are already maxed out, they're already maxed out. But when you're doing your research and you want to start investing, you definitely want something that, here's how I would put it, in an analogy, okay? So we're going to use the water balloon analogy. You want market cap is the water, okay? The goal is to get to this balloon to pop. So if you have a low supply, okay, which is a small balloon, then you're gonna need less water, which is the market cap, to make it pop. If you have a high supply, which is a bigger balloon, you're gonna need a lot more water, market cap, in order to make that balloon pop. Basically, to make profits. Hopefully that made sense. If not, comment down below and I'll clarify even more if you need to. Number four is use case. Basically, how useful is this coin? Is it scalable? meaning that it can handle high transaction volumes. For example, Ethereum, it was not made for high volume transactions. That's why the network fees are so ridiculously high. Number five, how strong is the community? Is there an active subreddit? Are they constantly posting updates? Are they keeping you updated? A strong community is really important. When you're constantly posting updates and awareness about your coin, it's very attractive to a potential buyer. <laughs> I was going to say sexy, but like, let me not. <laughs> so, and then finally, which brings me into number six, the branding. Very, very important. Your website needs to be clean, fresh looking. The logo needs to be clean and fresh. Things need to make sense. No typos, no errors. Like I want to see something like if I'm paying, if I'm paying for something, I want to see quality. Okay. Quality better. Not this two megapixel kind of freaking website or with uh, like ads all over it and freaking uh, typos everywhere. That's so unattractive. Nobody wants to buy something like that. If you're gonna go buy a Gucci sweatshirt and it only says G-U-G-I, what? Where's G-U-C-I? Whatever, you get the point. <laughs> now, some of the cryptos that I can tell you that meet this criteria are Elron, Neo, Bitcoin Balancer, Bitcoin Cash, Atom, Band, Bancor, just to name a few. And remember, if it starts with OX, it's Ethereum. Now, just to bring Bitcoin into the conversation, which is the godfather coin here, okay? Like I said, 21 max supply, 
and one trillion dollars is pumped into it, which is why the price skyrocketed so fast in a short period of time. That is your goal. You want to find a project or a coin where that is potentially what's going to happen. Now, just to get into some of the bonus questions that I feel people will ask is, what do you mean by use? Okay, let me break that down for you. <clears throat> Can you do a smart contract? Can you swap? Can you develop NFTs? Can you earn interest? Decentralized banking, which is basically like a bank in real life, but for crypto. Those are some of the uses that you want to see on a coin. If you just have Dogecoin, you can't do anything with it. It depreciates in value over time because the max supply is so high. Like, why, why? Why? The only reason it's so popular right now is, like I said, marketing and branding. It's all over the place. You've heard it all the time. You've seen Elon Musk talk about it. Like, but do your research. Just because there's a very famous developer that, or very, what's the word? I'm like, very famous billionaire behind something. Don't be fooled do your research. Another question I feel I might get is, okay, but what about a meme coin? What about BitCloud? What about these celebrity coins? These coins are basically pump and dumps. When you hear people say, that's a scam coin, that's a scam coin. Kind of, sort of, that's what it is. If you're a fan and you just love the celebrity so much, you love the, the project so much, go ahead, hold on to it like it's in a piece of art, like a my little Catwoman collection here, okay? That's basically what that is. It's like a collection. You can't do anything with it. There's no use. So, like, yeah. Some people think it's a scam coin because of the rug pull that tends to happen, yada, yada, yada. So, if you find a new project that you want to pump into and then dump, take profits along the way, nobody is telling you not to, okay? Just be smart with your money do your investing, do your research properly. Be smart. Now, the reason why these meme coins or celebrity coins or BitCloud, whatever you wanna call them, okay? The reason why they exist is because they saw what happened with Dogecoin. Like I said, Dogecoin, what, what are you gonna do with Dogecoin? It has no use. Come on now, be smarter than that. A lot of them just wanna pump it up take their profits and go. But I hope that was a little bit of an eye opener, awakener, kind of to try and teach you guys what you want to be looking at when you want to invest a coin, when you're trying to pick a project. Please always remember the six, okay? Liquidity, scarcity, market cap, use case, how strong is the community, branding. Come on now, you guys know better than to just pick something and roll with it. And also for those people that keep trying to just buy Bitcoin right now, you want to try and find the next best project that's coming up. So if you guys want to stay tuned on my crypto updates and whatnot, you can follow the Alt of Aries on Instagram. You can also follow my regular Instagram, Kimba Savvy, because I will post updates regularly. But it depends on my audience and if you guys still want to see more of this crypto stuff. So we'll see. Um, I will catch you guys in the next one. I have to get surgery and remove both of my wisdom teeth tonight. So we're going to see how I end up feeling because I'm not excited. I'm not ready for this. I like eating. So this is going to be very sad. Have a good one, guys.